Let's write the name for HGO. So first off, we need to recognize that mercury is a metal. It's actually a transition metal. And then oxygen, that's a nonmetal. Metal and a nonmetal, we're going to need to treat this as an ionic compound and make sure the charges balance as we write the name. The mercury here, since it's a transition metal, we're going to need to use Roman numerals between the two names. So HG, that's mercury. And then for oxygen, let's just write oxygen, lowercase o. And then we'll cross out the Y-G-E-N, the ending there, and put I-D-E. So far we have mercury oxide, but remember we said mercury, that's a transition metal. So we don't know what the charge here on mercury would be, but we do know that oxygen's two minus. Since that's two minus, the mercury, that has to be two plus. So we're gonna put a Roman numeral two between the mercury and the oxide. And that makes the name for HGO, mercury two oxide. If you were given the name and asked to write the formula for mercury two oxide, you'd know that mercury is going to be 2 plus, the oxygen's 2 minus, so these will balance out HGO. This is Dr. B with the name for HGO, mercury 2 oxide. Thanks for watching.